Well, hello my friend, my name is Attila and this is Mustard Piece. So here is the thing, all the mustard wood turners that I follow, they all know how to carve. So basically they turn a piece and they start to carve it. You probably have seen pictures of these beautiful hollow forms, lots of holes in it, looking like a spider web or a bone structure. So basically I have purchased two tools that allow me to produce such pieces and I'm going to use them for the first time then I'm, I figured why wouldn't I make a short video and give you my honest opinions on the tool and we make a sm small fun little project out of it probably a finia so the first tool I have purchased is called Proxon it is a mini jigsaw and because the base is not flat, you can put it on any surface and you can tilt it in any direction, whatever you want to. And the blade is really thin and intricate. And it's 12 volt, variable speed. So it shouldn't break your hollow form when the wall is like half a centimeter thick. So this is one of the tools I'm going to use. And I have also purchased carving machine that has the proper chuck on it. And it also has a pedal to control the speed. So just stop talking and let's just get on with it already. Jeez. Sawdust everywhere! Mustard piece. This is a big moment in a tool's life. It has never been used before. So here we go. design on it and we will use my new tool to cut it. Hopefully that will work. Thank you. 
here's the gun. <laughs> it seems to work very well. Didn't want to go any closer here. It's definitely precise. Let's make an insert. This is the design I am going to try to carve into this piece because I have just bought this kick-ass carving machine and I am eager to use it. Let's get to it. to this bit and this is kind of like sending bit
going to use this large diamond bit. Mustard piece. So before I'm going to give you the conclusion of the final product, let me just clarify. This is just a bonus video. I am still going to upload on Friday. And as a matter of fact, I made something really cool. I made a jewelry box that has a finger on it. So just pushing a lever up and down will open and close the lid on the jewelry box. So stay tuned for that. That's pretty cool video I guarantee you won't regret that and here is the final product a little bit of carving a little bit of jigsawing and now let me tell you what is my opinion on the tools so this thing is does exactly what it's supposed to do you can put it on any surface tilt it in any direction whatsoever you have seen it on the video it makes a pretty precise cut with this tiny saw blade so this is for wood turners this is for wood turners you can make those fancy hollow forms with this tool so carving machine basically this thing is incredible the only reason I changed my old tool I don't want to say the brand because they might sue me but it's a well-known brand probably have seen me using it before anyway so the only reason I have changed that because that tool broke down just died on me and it was the second time it died on me in a short period of time and just outside the warranty so I cannot get a replacement anymore so I figured I am going to buy a proper carving machine. Man, this thing just incredible. You cannot even compare to the old one. It doesn't vibrate. After using the old tool for like two hours, my, my fingers started tingling 
and there was a time in my life when I was carving every single day several hours for for like two weeks and after two weeks I started to develop chronic pain in my joints with this one no vibration and because I can control the speed with my feet it doesn't burn the wood easily so guys there is only one more thing to say if you made it at the end of this video thank you for watching and as always i hope to see you on the next one